Hi guys, hello and welcome to Inceptor Gaming. Well, I'm very excited for this video. Reason being, there's a, a very big game I've been waiting for for a very long time. Yes, that's right. It is no other than Cyberpunk 2077. Those of you who know me know that I tend to do strategy RTS type games a lot. I do enjoy them. They are among my favourites. But this game, I could not leave this alone. I had to. I had to jump on the bad wagon and play this game. I could not. <laughs> let this game pass me by this game had to appear in one of my videos so here we go just so starting off with the intro here good morning night city, night city. yesterday's body count lottery rounded out to a solid and sturdy 30 10 out of haywood thanks to unabated gang wars one officer down so i guess you're all screwed because the ncpd will not let that go mm -hmm, we know that go Another blackout in Santo Domingo. Netrunners are at it again, poking holes in the power grid. Down those netrunners. All over in Westbrook, trauma teams scraping cyber psycho victims off the oh, 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 oh. See the decapitation and here, that was Pacifica. mad. Yeah. Well, Pacifica is still yep, Pacifica. Pacifica is just Pacifica. This has been your man, Stan. Join me for another day in our city of dreams. Yeah, baby. Now, I will point out, this video is a long video. And the reason being is because I have uh, added in a couple of the tutorial levels and everything there that, that you have to do at the beginning of the game. So, you know, this is a no holds barred getting started right from the ground up from the absolute beginning. So, here we go. Here's the first screen you're presented with. Basically, choose your path. You can start as the Corpo route. So you know, from from the going from the high and mighty, or you can go as the street kid route. So you know, to sort of down and out, brought up by drug dealers, gang bangers, pushers, whatever you want to call them. And this is the route that I think I'm going to go for. This is the nomad route. I do like the idea of free roaming, doing what I want when I want, and taking whatever the fuck I want from whoever. So. That is my route. Here is my character creation. So, look at the details of the graphics. Look at the details of the face. Those faces look absolutely amazing. They look second to none. I have never seen a game so far where the graphics of the characters look this good. So anyway, I'm going to uh, configure my character here. I'm going to sort of basically, loosely base the character on kind of like myself in a way. You know, slight, slight similarities between how the character looks and how I look in real life. Not that any of you know that, but, you know, so here we go. Nice short haircut. Yeah, that's me all over. Uh, eyes. You can put some very funky eyes in this game, so I am going to do that in a moment. Get a decent sort of look that I like the look of, yeah. I mean, look at this. The details are just absolutely second to none. This is awesome beyond words. Yeah, that'll do for the eyes. Okay, eye colour. Now, you can put in some really funky, weird and wonderful eyes here. So that's pretty much what I'm going to do. Don't want to put love hearts though. I am a guy. I am a straight guy. I don't want people to give... Ooh. Little red circles, yeah, I'll go with that. The black background. Change your eyebrows a bit. <laughs> no eyebrows. No, I'll give him some eyebrows. Uh, might change eyebrow colour slightly, just to maybe sort of tie in similar to the hair. Possibly, yeah, that'll do. That's good enough. Let's change the nose, maybe. Have a look around at the nose options here. Yeah, that'll do. I think I might go with that one. Yeah, that, that, that suits me perfectly. Okay, change the lips. Okay, I don't want the lips to be too big, you know. Otherwise, it's going to look like he's... Uh, 
enjoys a bit too much giving all services to other dudes. We're not having that. So, don't want to make him look too feminine either, do we? So, just got some big fat chunky jaws go on available there, but now I'll do something a bit more slender looking, a little bit more pleasing to the ladies, I reckon. So, look at the ears. Oh, yeah, they look quite good. I might go with those ones possibly, yeah. Okay, go with that. I'm not into beards and stuff myself. I don't have a beard, so I'm going to not skip that. Let's look at the cyberware options. Well, you can have no option, but no sod that I will have a cyberware option. Oh, I quite like the look of that one, maybe. Yeah, not too intrusive, not too kind of in your face, but you can see he's been uh, he's been jacked up a bit. Eh? He's had a bit of, bit of tech work going on in his features there. That's a bit too much, that one. Across the bridge of the nose? Nah. I think the eye ones do look quite cool, but no, I'm gonna, I think I'm going to go for these. Probably suits me best in real life, to be fair. Facial scars. <laughs> Even the scars look really, really good. But no, I'm going to have him looking quite sort of clean cut. Um, just considering with the options here. My mouse also seems to have thrown a bit of a wobbler for some reason. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. I will get my mouse back into control, I swear. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn off the facial scars. There's no need for that. Maybe the game progresses. If I can edit later, maybe I will. Special tattoos is an option, but no, I'm not really into tattoos that much. <laughs> Some piercing options there, but no, that's not really my style, to be honest. I do like the idea of being able to change the teeth, though. Silver and ashes. Gold. I reckon gold and ashes would, would do, yeah, yeah, that's fine. Don't need to do any makeup colours, like I say, I am not, uh, that is not my scene. I am a straight male, an alpha. Uh, let's have a look at the nails. Uh, nails are fine. <laughs> Nipples on or off though, <laughs> that's interesting. You can turn them on and off. Body tattoos. I wonder if you can change this later or maybe add new tattoos that haven't been, uh, that aren't in the default menu yet, but I'll leave that for later maybe. Body scars, yeah, just have a little look there, but no, I don't think I'll bother with scars. Okay, okay. Now, I have seen this talked about in a few different forms. Yes, it is true. You can customise the genitals. <laughs> so, basically, your options for the genitals <laughs> are cut, uncut, and even a vagina. So, if you want to have a male character with a vagina, you're more than welcome to go and do that. Uh, also, you can increase penis size as well. <laughs> so, if you want to have a big one, Default or a little a little wiener, you can give them a little wiener. I'm assuming, conversely, I haven't seen the female characters, but I'm assuming you can give the women a penis as well if you wish. But no, I'm going to stick with a normal uncut penis, default size. You know, don't want to brag, don't want to uh, you know make out I'm a wiener. I'm not, so average will do. Now the pubic hair options that was quite amusing as well. Uh, I think I'll just go for a bit of a. A bit of a like uh, almost target looking thing there you know directing the ladies down to the junk to where it's got to be okay let's move on now to our attributes so, uh, body attributes intelligence attributes i do like i do like the idea of uh, having it quite high on the intelligence scale purely for hacking and things of that nature Reflex is always a good thing to have as well, though, because, you know, you want to be uh, quick reactions, respond to things uh, in an instant, so that's also a good thing to improve. Technical ability, so he's, uh, his understanding of tech weapons and locking doors, okay, that's also a good one. Coolness. Resilience and composure in effect in operating from st with stealth, okay. That's also a good attribute to have, but... I'm going to go for the highest attributes on intelligence, 
and everything else increased by one. So I think that'll do for me. That's my character. Nomad with a free and easy kind of lifestyle and background. Just the way he uh, just the way he rolls there. So here we are on the loading screen. Cyberpunk is a big game, uh, very graphically intensive. So yeah, my mid-range system, it does take a little while to load up some of the scenes, to be fair. But that's only to be expected. Okay, so here we go. <laughs> now, who noticed the obvious mistake there, eh? He's looking into the mirror. He's looking at his T-shirt. That's fine. No problem with that. You said it was nothing whatsoever. serious when I came in. But you said you were sure. Then, when he looks down to rip the banker's patch off, he's wearing a waistcoat. Where did the waistcoat come from? <laughs> so I'm afraid there is a few uh, little glitches I've encountered in this game so far. But not to worry. I am enjoying the game overall. Uh, you know, it's not quite perfect, but I'd say so far from what I've seen, I'd say yes, the game's about 95% perfect in terms of what I have seen. Can shop where they won't ask a lone nomad why he's hugging the border? Oh, is that right, mate? Okay. That's fine. Step aside. What? <laughs> Goodbye. I'm going to fix this myself, mate. What to do? <clears throat> I'm going to bypass the coupling and rig a hot water. Yep. Bypass sounds the like a plan. Run on and on. It could seize up. Did anyone ask your opinion? <laughs> I like the way you can give people, uh, you know, a little bit of sass if you want, a bit of, uh, you know, excuse me, mate, okay. what are you on about? Let's see what happens. It's like I was telling you. No. Yeah, typical mechanic. I told you, it's busted. It's not going to run. Oh, and all not of a sudden, at all. it runs. Questions: How long it'll last you? Yeah, it'll get me to Night City. Yep. I figure something else out there. All I gotta do is get to Night City, that's all I want. So I've got an option here to plug in the radio, so let's have a look at that. Mm -hmm. Okay, proper, no uh, no expense spared on the much. old radio there. Not liable to hear much. You don't say. Hey Mike, didn't know you had a customer. Uh, rolled in a few hours past, mm -hmm. I, I, I thought uh, he'd at least called in. Got a don't sheriff in town, okay. We're gonna hash it out. Don't you know you owe the sheriff a word when you pay his town a visit? To tell him what's brought you here. Maybe even over a cup of coffee. No need to worry. I won't be staying long. Didn't answer my question now, did you? Nope. Name's Andrew Jones. Probably heard of him. <laughs> Who? You can't say that I have. Served in spec ops during the last war. Silver show guns? Ring any bells? Nope. I can't say that it does. Don't like to get along, do ya? Not with pricks like you, mate. No chance in fucking hell. That a nomad vehicle? Sure is. Might have expected that. If you have a problem, I'm willing to hear it. Yeah, come on, let's have Let some, mate. Come on. I'm is. dusting for, for a fight here. Come on, Nothing let's have it. Nothing boils my blood like a fucking stray. Ooh, ow. Where's your <laughs> clan pitch camp? It's none of your fucking business, mate. There is no clan. There is no camp. I'm here alone. I ain't buying it. Nomads always stick to their packs. My family's in pieces. That's why I'm headed for Night City. Makes you an outcast among outcasts. Yeah, so sure well. I hope you'll be on your way before long. I saw broadcast and comms tower on my way in. My antenna's down, and I need to radio someone. What you need's to hightail it out of here without another word. Mm -hmm, is that right? Ain't got no mind to see you drifting around these parts. Got it? 
God, this bloke is one fucking you asshole. You like the sound of your voice, don't you? What's that, Drifter? What are you on about? Nothing. Nothing at all. <laughs> yeah. Best that way. To be honest, you, I do prefer uh, first-person views at all times, even when driving. Although, uh, <laughs> I think I've got to work on my driving skills, actually, at the moment, in this particular game, yeah. You'll see my driving skills are not actually the best right now. <laughs> Neither is my sense of direction. Okay, so here we go to the radio tower. This old tower sounds a bit rickety. Hoping things didn't uh, collapse from under me. Hello? Come in. Come in. Ah, raised you finally. Willie McCoy, it's good to hear your voice. Fee. Wish I could say the same. I need your help. One last time. One last time? Again? I have to find the client with my payload, but I don't know where he is. Hmm. Right place, right time. You were there? My car gave out. The electric coupling. It's a miracle I made it here. Maybe the client left a message. Could you check for me? Last time, though, I mean it. Client's name? Jackie Wells. Huh. Actually left a message. Okay, then. He's waiting on a farm. Flicking you the geolope data. Thanks, Willie. I owe you one. You do. Just don't get yourself killed. Okay. And don't call again. So then two guys there got some history. Uh, I hope the story will progress and be able to find out what happened there. That'll be good. Good to know. I better get down from this tower. Tell you what, it sounds like uh, quite a powerful motor for a, a knackered old nomad vehicle. Okay, new area, Dry Creek, okie dokie. Oh, bit of off-road driving there. <laughs> like I say, uh, my driving skills at this point in the game do need some work. I'm not going to lie, I'm not going to hide it. But hey. It is what it is. Oh, I was worried I'd have to turn to farming. <laughs> yeah, sure hope you're here for me. I believe I am. Are you... Name's Jackie Wells. V. Seems you have cargo that needs to be moved. 
Oh, where I'm from, you share a bit about your soul before you talk biz, eh? It's kind of like a custom. Or just good manners, you know? Why don't we start with you, then? NC native, right here. Got Haywood in my blood. I've never been to NC. That doesn't mean much to me. So, imagine a place where everyone's like your bro or sis. Or a <laughs> distant cousin, at least. <laughs> I think I understand. You don't have to like each other, but it's family. That's Haywood. That and everyone's back in iron. And you? I guess one could say I'm from my own Haywood. You and me, we're gonna get along fine. The cargo. Let's load it in the car. Yep. <clears throat> Let's get it. Oh, I've just spotted some in the uh, bottom corner of the room there. So I'm gonna have a little nose around his gaff. Started thinking you might not come. I got held up. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna come. You weren't exactly little, uh, easy to find. Surgical scissors. I decided to lay low, you know. What if I can use them for, uh, later on. Look like one grouchy motherfucker. With a stabbing implement, perhaps. Yep. Let's grab a few items. All right, I found some money. Nice one. Forty-five bucks already. Okie dokie. I've not even played the game yet. Okay. Okay, we've got a shard. Right, let's have a butcher's. So rules of being a nomad and a bit of background on nomad life. Okie dokie. Mm -hmm. Strange expression for quite a small car, but anyway, not to worry. <laughs> for a small boot, I should say. Are we headed out? Yep. Where are we going? Do you have the manifest from the transport? Of course I do. But the fixer didn't give you the job deeds. He... He did. I was just making sure. Listen, friend. We're both professionals, ain't we? Mm, kind of. Hey, you, uh, sure you've moved contraband before? Why, are you nervous? Me? <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> like I said about my dodgy driving there <laughs> a little bit earlier. <laughs> well, uh, I will get the hang of it, I promise. Little. I guarantee you that. Scan us and check our papers. Yeah, we've got to go through the crossing whether we like it or not. Okay. I'll do the talking. Please direct your vehicle to the inspection area. Remain in your vehicle. The security check will begin shortly. Oh, I might chill out. No need to shout. I God. got a real bad feeling about this. Hand me the manifest. Don't need to see it. Grab these. Let me see. <laughs> it's marked LOA. Perfect. What's that mean? Lost on arrival. It means the cargo is flagged as to be lost as soon as it crossed the border. Oh, so they know we're smuggling. They're about to find out. The owner of the vehicle in the inspection area will report for further questioning. <sighs> Great. <laughs> what now? We want the customs officer to turn a blind eye to our dubious docus. We'll need a sweetener. Do you have the credit chip with the bribe? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Forgot about that. Of course you did, mate. <laughs> right. Of course you did. You forgot. Keep the engine running. Please do. Do that. If you're armed, place your weapon here. Now that is one awesome looking hand cannon. <laughs> I do like revolvers, but that now is a revolver and a half. That two. thing's a beast. Please sit. Papers. 
I know the rules. Everything's there. It might be. It might not be. We'll see. Hmm. What are you transporting? It's all in there. Everything? There's one additional enclosure to the manifest. Ah, yes. Remind me, you drive for which nomad clan? None. No clan. I drive for myself. Yep, none of your business, Bold. mate. And none too wise. You know, whenever I see someone like you, I'm oh so grateful not to be on that side of the table. <laughs> and I want to be Feelings like that guy. <laughs> You'd no chance. Go on now. Your associate's waiting for you in the car. Don't forget to take your personal items. Come on, come on. Be careful with that toy. Give me a toy. Yeah, welcome to Night City. Mate, that thing looks like it's more of an anti-aircraft gun than a, than a revolver. Is some kind of paradise. What can you do? Mm. Young, naive. Which is just a euphemism for what ignorant. happened in there? I'll tell you soon. We need to get out of here. Yep. Yeah, okay. You gonna tell me what happened back there? The customs dickhead got nitpicky. And that ain't normal? Not to that extent. Smelling trouble around the bend? Drive, Jackie, just drive. Someone's coming our way. This does not look good. Stop your vehicle immediately. Let's get out of here. It's on go. You are transporting contraband that is corporate property. Okay. I repeat, stop the car. Playing the game a short time, and now I've got one of the corpos on my ass. <laughs> Let's go. All right, okay, little tutorial about good combat. Now comes a hand cannon. Oh, I've put the car on fire already. Nice one. Trying to shoot the driver if possible. Nice. <laughs> I knew that thing was a little cannon in my hand. <laughs> I can blow this one up as well. Put a few more shots in it. Oh, I missed it. Okay. Back again. Ooh, okay, he's gone. Gotta keep moving. Oh, those pendejos are stubborn. Well, taking some damage. And the vehicle's gone as well. Nice one. I love that little hand cannon, that's awesome. Mierda. Who's cold? We can't stop here. Place looks deserted. Gonna stop here. Need to sort out a few things before we go on. Fucking hell. I almost tagged our asses. Is that what you call smuggling? Go! Hello, mate. All right. We're supposed to go smooth. No problems! Calm down. Sometimes these this, things happen. What kind of shit happened? Border security tipped off the corporation that we have their cargo. What's the deal with these borderlies flipping us the finger as they fucking please? 
with no consequences. He took a risk. He assumed we didn't have a clan backing us, and he was right. <sighs> so what now? We've crossed the border. Now you pay me, and we go our separate yep. ways. Show me the money, mate. Uh, I ain't gonna lie. I'm a bit light. I can't pay you now. Oh, okay. I have something for you once I collect my scrap for this corporal crap we're oh, carrying. Huh. And you just figured I would sit by patiently. Actually, I wasn't gonna pay you at all. Also. Ah, bust ass and disappear as soon as we crossed over, but you're all right. So you tricked me. Oh, well, apologies for offending the spotless moral code of a smuggler. <laughs> so, what's next? Now we take a peek inside. Yeah, why not? After what we've just gone through. Open it. Aw, oh, shit. It says Arasaka on the crate. We are robbing some heavy hitters. And maybe we'll make some heavy money. Yeah, that would be good. Oh, mames. A real iguana. A, uh, lesser Antillian, I think. Lesser Antill what? Yeah, I watched the thing on TV about them. Went extinct like 30 years ago. They're from the Lesser Antilles. You come a long way, my scaly friend. Not sure poking it is a good idea, but... You think you can make some money on it? That is the option I have. <laughs> sure. Think it'll make us happy. Us? Yeah, partner. We'll go half seas. Any decent fixer will find a loaded gunk interested in a rare gem like this. It's kind of a shame, though. I always wanted a pet. Got the name Manny all thought out. Hey, by the way, you, uh, got any plans for what you'll be doing in Night City? Nothing really. Why do you ask? Because I got this feeling you got a lot of time and nothing to spend it on. And NC ain't a city that lets you get by without buddies. But don't you worry. Let me help you find Diggs. You gotta live somewhere. It's important to have people you can turn to. You know, like uh, family. Maybe you'll find your own down in Night City. Yeah, why not? Thanks. Much appreciated. Hey, come on. It's nothing. It got chemistry, you and me. Be a crying shame to waste it. Partner. Hey! Aw, cuddly little fucker. Okay, partner. Time to grab the lizard and scurry out of here. <laughs> yeah, so as I said before, the uh, loading times can't be helped on fight. My system is kind of mid-range, so, uh, you know, it does take a little while uh, on this particular game. <laughs> oh, I love this town. Love it like you might love a mother who popped you out on the steps of an orphanage once and now stops you to ask if you got a smoke for her. Every new day here means a hundred new arrivals, but only half these gonks will survive a year, and that's if it's a good one. And why do these peeps come to NC? Well, to be Bit of a glitch on that car then for a moment. <laughs> So they say, but you can only be a major league player for so long. The faster you live, the faster you burn out. If you don't get a bullet to the brain first. Whoops. <laughs> uh, tooth out. <laughs> Not to we. My guy can take it. NC's legends. Know where you'll find most of them? The graveyard. <laughs> Jackie, there's a big kid. <laughs> He's a big kid with the two guns, huh? Matters not where you start. What matters here is the walk you walk. In Night City. The city of dreams.
Yeah, again with the loading times, I'm afraid I do apologise about that. It can't be helped. Chick we're looking for is somewhere in this building. Probably crawling with the pendejos that kidnapped her. Okay, six months Eyes later. Eyes and ears open, right? Speaking of which, got you a little something. Militech training shard. In case you need to uh, brush up on your dance moves. Yeah, why not? Down for some target practice yep. in VR? Sure. Why the hell not? Let's begin with basic combat training. This session will be recorded for subsequent evaluation. This course is designed to reinforce your fundamental combat abilities and hone your reflexes. The skills you gain here will help you survive, even excel on the battlefield. I will train you to be effective with firearms, to use stealth tactics to advantage, and to hack into enemy networks. Because at Militech... Man, Militech can't encrypt for shit. But they clearly got drilling jarheads in their blood. Yep, and you're better looking now, than that goon, darling. Station one, you maggot! Move, move, move! Let's blast through a tactical target practice program. You know, a little warm up. I think you'd find that too tough. What do you say we crank it up a notch? Not bad. But it's more realistic if it... Quit standing around and take cover! You took a hit. Use a reanimator to patch yourself up. Head to the training area when you're good to go. Oh, look. Brought some tombs with him this time. You know what to do. Okay, so he's got some buddies, right? Let's take these all down, shall we? Yeah, that's him gone. Okay, you go for going the right, I think. Like Santa's presenting himself. A few shots on him. Cap the guy on the right. Come on. Need to get you, mate. Okay, just a bloke in the middle. Let's see if I can get a good headshot if possible. Bye! <laughs> That's him, Gion. Stand on the platform and we'll move on. <clears throat> Hacking's the next item on the menu. Might notice I tweaked the course material a bit. Yeah, hacking is definitely very important in this game, as I've found out as I've been playing. It's uh, yeah, a big, big part of this game. Okay, so let's just show us where... Uh, the different types of objects we can scan and, if, and what we can do with them, if anything. This training module will teach you how to apply. Work a little hack magic on the screen to distract the guard. Corpo trash. Style over substance. Yep. Good. Now take him out quietly. All right, all yours. Take him out. 
I need to grab a kill or non-lethal option there. Um, Especially the dead I got a feeling there's going to be plenty of lethal takedowns in my game. Okay. Now try to take him down in one slick move. That's him gone. Nice and easy. Okay. What's next? Ready to try hacking some gonks in real time? Yeah, why not? Have fun. Okay, so first thing, hack the camera. Uh huh. Breach protocol. Okay, let's break into his system then. Now, detonate the grenade. Okay. Grenade detonation, let's go. <laughs> Bye. See? Just needed to shut your brain down and follow orders. In true Militech fashion. Under my wise command, you're a real champ. Not too shabby. Militech's algorithms put you on a decent run. Got additional modules if you want to hone any other skills. Or you finish up, dealt out now. Yeah. But remember, the street's not going to give you any hints or second chances. Yeah, might as well check out those other modules. Right. So first, let's shape up those stealth skills. Okay, so we can tag all the guys there. Highlights them so we know where they are. Brilliant. Against cover, that's fine. Nice. nice. <clears throat> now move slowly towards the exit. Stay out of sight. Nova, well done. On to the next area. Now the same thing, only with the camera. Okay, hack a camera. Let's have a look. Oh, okay, I see. So there's little beams there. Show us where it's looking. Brilliant. Stand on the platform to exit the sim. All right, some advanced combat techniques for dessert. Yep, let's have it. Wrap this party up. Time to get down and dirty in close quarter combat. Take them down, but careful. Looks tough. Yeah, that didn't work. <laughs> okay, that'll do. Now maybe we find someone closer to your weight class. Okay, so some basic punch moves. Okie dokie. Okay, let's do a combo. Yeah, that's that done. So yeah, hold the button for a big attack. Okay. Right. No doubt about stamina runs down if we keep fighting, keep punching stuff. Excellent. Okay. Let's bump things up from easy to normal. This next fool can block your attack. Okay, so big punch opens the opens them up. Brilliant. Dull bit coming up now. Blocking blows instead of dealing. So you stamina and blocking as well, okay. Oh, a boot to the face I got there. <laughs> I 
Okay, so a good push there. Must, uh, with a lot of fights, come before a big punch. I need to remember that. Oh yeah, and nice little counter, counter on the on the chin there. Go on. Boom. Bye. <laughs> Want to see this fool punch an air next? Okay. Don't let him land. Got a dodge. Anything. All right. Okay, trying to take this guy down. Let's have it. Come on, let's have it. I can teach you no more. He went down nice and easy. Right, what's next? Move on to melee weapons. Grab a sword. Alright, Katana. Let's have this. So it's the same moves to block and everything. Okay, right with the katana. Oh, you got me. Uh, come on, let's have it. So I must be able to counter with it as well. So that's a standard block, yeah. Oh, you got me in there. And got a little counter on the go, I believe. Right, oh, let's go. Yes, that was a counter. <laughs> nice. Down. Good. Now show me what you've learned. Okay, so we've got a big one. Uh, yeah, a couple of regular goons and uh, quite a big one there. So I'm going to get him to suicide himself. <laughs> by a hack. Take his bloke down with a sword. You know, he's gone. Come on, really. I thought he was gone. That's him. So that's him, the biggest one uh, suicided himself at my command. And I'm just going to shoot this bloke to shit. Where is he? Oh, I didn't mean to uh, to hear myself there, but it's not a problem. Damn, these guys can take some hits, these robots. Good stuff. Looks like you're cruising already. Up on the platform. Yep, let's get out of here. Let's let's crack on with our mission now, shall we? Good luck, B. So? Not bad, huh? But now we can get down to biz. Yep, yeah. let's do let's this. Let's crack on. Elevator, this way. Let's have a little scan around, see if there's anything uh, useful I can pick up. Even anything I can sell later. Yeah, I'll pick that up. Oh, there's something in there. Another star. Ooh, handcuffs. I wonder if I can actually use them in the game at any point. Could be handy if I can. Oh, there's a nifty little slide there. I'm going to have to uh, remember how to do that one for a later date. Okay. Target's Sandra Dorset. Target's Biomon went mute a couple hours back. Suspected abduction. Target could have possibly flatlined already. Not sure you're in time. We're in time, Bug. We. Sure you're on phones, but that don't make you any less part of this squad. squad. Charming. And I got a feeling she's not a people person. Calm the hell down, both of you. Almost there. Yeah, Bug. You focus. Jackie with his two guns there. Quick scan around. Oh, some stuff I can pick up. I see vinyl seems uh, popular in 2077. Ooh, another house stem there, okay. Looking for 1237. Target should be inside, but I got zero eyes on her bioma. Fingers crossed it's not too late. Oh, I hate this life or death shit. Oh, yes. Hurry. Is you? Uh, back in the... Back in your room there, darling. Mm, picked up some chocolate, Try okay. The Think you can trip it on your own, V? Yeah, I got this, okay. 
Give this thing a hack. That will scan as well straight away. Yeah, chill out, Jackie. I'll have a look in a minute. I'm busy collecting. Oh, what's this? I've got some money there. Hey, you got some more bucks. Okie dokie. Scan the corpse. Standard Dorset's protected under Echelon 2 Corpo Immunity. That's not her then, right? Girl's top shelf. This one's packing black market Zeta Tech repros. Typical back alley fix ups. Not our lucky gal. Let's keep looking. Much on demand. Okay. Okay, so it's all about state of health care and things. Okie dokie. Okay, not to worry. Okay, it's trouble ahead, right. It's going to take the make kit there, okay. Sneak up on this dude. <laughs> there we go, out of the way, mate. Done. Right, what's this? Oh, picked up some kind of goggles there, eh? okay. Another uh, info shard. Subway usage and its side effects, okay. So this one talks all about the, uh, the different side effects and usage of shards. Oh, sorry, of cyberware, okay. Physical effects implementation, okay. Mm. On your toes. More bodies incoming. They're almost on you. Please fuck these creepers. Oh, yeah, hey, they're coming. Wait for your chance. Pick the prick off. Take the one on the right here, sneak up on him. Right, what's he got? Let's loot him. It's definitely good to loot all the corpses and everything you come across. Oh, I already picked it up. Okay, thought we still had something there to loot, but no. Scan the route. Ooh. Uh, okay, destruction device, a fan, okay. There's a guy over there. No. Okay, so he's off investigating the fan I've started, right? Just gonna sneak up on this dude. And good night. Okay, he's still there. Now I'm going to uh, sneak up behind this bloke. <laughs> Bit of a glitch there, yeah? he's a... Uh, Seems to have magically uh, gone into, <laughs> into the lockers there. <laughs> yeah, a bit of graphics glitch, I'm afraid. Not to worry. Let's pick up this shit. Something else to loot. Shotgun, okay. Plenty of things to loot on this uh, in this room here, so let's grab as much stuff as I can. More cash, thank you very much indeed. Yeah, final guys over there, right? Let's 
go the uh, sneaky route, shall we? He nearly spotted me. Okay, yep. Use a destruction hack. Okay, so, just going to find the last, uh, might as well uh, loot as much as I can as well. What's this one, what's this, uh, what's this shard on about? Painted as a mortality rate, okay. So clearly my first few uh, shards I'm picking up here, I'll give you information about the, you know, the effects of cyberware and stuff, and um, possible side effects and things to be wary of. Yeah, some ammo there. I didn't get that before. More ammo, excellent. How is it? Flat out doubt we could be that sneaky. Man, it's not my favorite way to roll, but So much stuff to loot, that's fine by me. Oh, hey, uh, more cash. Let's have the cash. Cash is good, I like cash. And the shard. Okay. The fourth cup at war. So there was a war in 2023, according to this. And that changed everything. Alright. Yeah, it's don't look good. Okay, push him out of the way. Is that my last? Is that my target? Got, got our target. Yeah, it is. We make it? She alive? About to find out. V, jack into our biomod. Need to know what we're dealing with. Jacking in. Oh, this does not look good. Sandra Dorset, NC570442. Traumatine Platinum. Platinum? Shit. Trauma should have swooped in if she sneezed. Guessing they jammed the transmitter, Sig. Looking at a hacked biomon, firmware reconfig, or a neurovirus. Carajo, T-Bug. You ain't seeing this place. This is tubs, ice, hooks, and cleavers. Hmm. Scott Muncher's hack, huh? Got an idea. Check her neural cord. Find a shard? Yeah, pull it. That'll be what's muting the biomon. Found the shard. We're moving now. Check the biomon. Anything change? Greetings, Sandra. If you are conscious, assume recovery position. An emergency evacuation unit has been dispatched and is due to arrive at your location in 180 seconds. Biomon claims trauma will be here in three minutes. Your premium plan will cover 90% of the projected costs of your rescue and treatment. Let's get her off that ice. Oh fuck! Ooh, system right. malfunction. What happened there? Jackie, air on. hypo. Fuck, this is bad. It gets what all? I think. Holy shit! It worked. Where I run? Get her outside. Scavrats abandoned its ship. Must have seen trauma. Decided to cut their losses. Landing. Stand clear. Initiating security protocol. Follow all instructions. Damn, these medics come in heavy. <laughs> these aren't like the kind of ambulance crews I'm used to seeing around the place. <laughs> Five 
five steps back. Now. Oh, he's rough as well. <laughs> These guys do not mess about at all, do they? TT 133 to control. Patient NC 570442 secured. Stimulus being administered. 70 milligrams dopamine. 110 norepinephrine. 800 for Grenadine. Shit show's over. Cutting my wires now. See you in the near future. Listen, Mano. I got this thing. Mind if I borrow your wheels? Oh, I suppose you can, Jackie. I got a day with Misty, but I can't take the metro. How's it gonna look for me? Only if you hang it, Jack. But don't get used to it. You're saving my ass, V. Thank you. How about I drive you home, huh? <laughs> See that glitch? Yeah, he just walked through the <laughs> through the lift doors. <laughs> oh, almost forgot. Like I say, yeah. This game is uh, it looks bloody done. good, but it is like not quite perfect. I'd say about ninety-five percent perfect. There's a few little annoying glitches like that. <clears throat> v, how did it go? Our client is alive and well. Yeah, kind of. But do I just tell her uh, she'll live, or just uh, do I say relatively speak? Do I be, yeah, be kind of honest, Scott? Relatively well. Trauma team took her off our hands. She'll recover. Splendid. Your payment awaits you. Ready to come and grab whenever you like, even right away. But I guess home is the only place you wish to be now. The NCPD has surrounded Watson. The district is closed. If you're to make it past the cordon, you must move fast. Thanks for the heads up. I quit scan that in case anything I missed, but I think I got it all. Without the NCPD, he's gonna put Watson on lockdown. If I'm gonna sleep in my own bed tonight, we better put it in fifth. Oh, I wanna grab that. Leave it to me, man. Oh, I can't, I'm okay. Uh, maybe I've maxed out on uh, that particular item or something, but I can't seem to pick that one up. Okay. Yeah, I'll leave it. It's not important, really. No signs of anything else, I don't think. Yeah, my car there looks a bit better than the old one I had. Long. Oh, we've got a new gig job, okay. 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 Stop digging night city. City like any other. I mean, Jackie, I'm digging it quite well myself so far. Not just any other city. Morgan Blackhand, Anthony Wayland, Adam Smasher. Legends are born here. Starving. Let's grab a tight bite. What do you say? Jackie. They're locking down Watson, remember? Oh shit, you're right. Is it just me? I know it. Oh, we got some more action. Okay. Fucking drive, Jackie. Yeah, man, get us out of here. Come on, V, shoot! Can't keep her steady. Oh, there's one guy, a oh, gun on the back of the van there. Oops. Come on, Jackie, keeps on the road, mate. Mierda, perdón! Got you, no idea what I was trying to do right there, but hey, anyway, not to wait. Let's take the driver. Yeah, let's take the driver. Yep, he's gone, fine. Scratched your baby up pretty bad. Sorry, V. It's okay. It can wait. Let's just focus on getting home. Okay, don't know what that was then. Right. 
Yes. Damn. I'm pulling out all the stops. Okay. Oh, I can't hack that. I wanted to hack it. <laughs> I wanted to hack that big ass robot. <laughs> Necessary security measures. Officer, ma'am! Damn, are we ever lucky we ran into you. Really? What's it that makes me so special? A uh, heart of gold? Because only somebody with a heart of gold can understand just how much I need to get back to my girl. Your girl? Uh-huh. I'm going to be worried sick if I don't show. I mean, I'm trying to be a stand-up guy. Check out Jackie here with the old sweet talk. <laughs> That's a shame. Look at him. No model citizen, maybe, but he's a good kid. Let them through, but they're the last. Okay, on your way. You have a good evening now, officer, ma'am. <laughs> So you can be nice when you feel like it. When am I not nice? Because <laughs> it's you, Jackie. Always. I'm always never not nice. <laughs> Pull the other one out, mate. Pull the other one. Oh, that didn't get well for them guys. Max tech. Damn. PD's Apex Predators. Impact rolls in when things fly out of hand. Dogs up there though. Just a good day snack for them. Well, show's over. Old bastards. But they had it coming. your place great what job you <laughs> not likely to make it back to Haywood now chill V don't let me through sure about that oh yeah I'll play nice Jack in here Dreams, then. Yeah, cheers, mate. Have a good one. Don't miss the I said hi. I will. Hi, luego. So, a little scan around here. Anything I can value, anything I can pick up, anything I can uh, make use of, any money lying around. Seems to be a bit of money lying around the place occasionally. Appears like I got everything on here. Okay, on this uh, in this area, nothing by looks of it. Okay, let's go up to my flat. Fortunately, after their rescue and following a brief rest for technical evaluation, the miners were able to immediately. Good evening, Night City. My first guest tonight is the president of the Bug. Forgot earlier. A runner I know has something you could probably use. Zip in your deeds. Praise be to me. Okay. So give me something to improve my networking skills. That could be good to know. I'll, I'll have to uh, investigate that definitely. Okay, let's grab some stuff from around the place, shall we?
I can't Heading collect that, okay. Gotta be There's one flat there. Gonna have a word with the super. Oh, yeah. Ah, you wanna have a good time? Mm, not with a skunk like you, I don't know, thanks. Oh, something in there. Hello, hello. Damn, that's a lot of money. That's just doubled my cash. Excellent. I knew it was, I knew it was definitely worth looking around on this level. So let that be a tip to you guys. If you've not played this game yet, if you're thinking about getting this game, please A, do buy the game. It is awesome. But two, check and look everywhere for anything of use because you know there could be money there could be all kinds of things that may be beneficial for you or you can sell on or whatever make sure you do that very very important so let's check out my stash here got more weapons than i need so let's uh put the lesser weapons into the stash the ones that are duplicates the ones that maybe are not as powerful or as good i'll keep the shotgun I'll keep that weapon as well. So I'll keep I'll keep one decent pistol for myself. Uh, keep the other two weapons. That'd be good. So I look through my various other inventory items there. Things I can okay. So some chocolate. Actually, no. I'm going to keep all my inventory items on me because uh, some things might be uh, able to use at some point. Other things might be. Uh, Able to sell or something. Just check my own uh, inventory here. Oh, I got character upgrades. So I'm Merc one percent. Okay. What well, I'm one percent Merc rating. Okay. I got a perk and I got an attribute. So what's have a look at? Coolness. Nah. Intelligence. Yeah, that is good already though. Body could be handy. Street brawler. Reflexes. Ooh. I'm thinking choice between body and and reflexes here. Eagle eye assault weapons. Hmm. I'm not 100 percent sure what to go for, to be honest. Pack mule so I can make myself uh carry more weights. Ooh, regeneration, that could be very handy, possibly. Yep. I'm going to use the perk on regeneration, definitely. But now, what for the attribute? Reflexes or body, I reckon. So, body versus physical power. Reflexes to speed and agility. Okay, reflexes, that'll do. Nice, right, have a little look around my flat. Okay, pick up some stuff. Ooh, vodka. <laughs> There's a shard there as well. What's the shard all about? Okay. It's all about brain dances, okay. Whatever, whatever brain dances, okay. I'll no doubt find out what that is as the game progresses. Hmm, fair enough. Hey, right, time to hit the hay, I think. Get my head down. Consider the first uh, the first day in Night City over. Well, I say first day, it's been about six months according to the story, but you know what I mean? My first play over, so uh, let's get my head down. And there we go. Thank you very much indeed for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoy my content in general. Please give me a like, give me a subscribe, and check out my future up-and-coming cyberpunk videos and some of the other videos. Thank you very much indeed, guys.